so I just got back from shopping at Ross and Rue 21. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys everything that I got. We'll start off with Rue 21 because I guess that's where I went first. And I have a swatch on my hand. Don't mind that. I will show you guys what that is for in just a second after I grab it out of my purse. So I got two lippies. The Rue 21 that is in the city kind of next to mine is going out of business like they're closing. So everything in the store was 20 to 50% off. So their makeup was like 30% off or something like that. So each of these lip products were like two dollars each or something so i decided to try them the first is a lip cream a matte lip cream and this is in the shade light pink and it just looks like this and this is the one that i have swatched on the back of my hand so it's kind of like a candy yum yum barbie pink um but that's what that looks like and this has been on my hand like i've scrubbed it off and like used soap and water and it hasn't come off yet so i have high hopes for this one um, and then I just got this lipstick and this, I'm not quite sure exactly what it is. It says on the bottom, uh, Rue Beauté, but I don't know like what shade it is, but it is like a light pink and I love the packaging on this. It is so cute. It's like a floral detail. And then this is like a really light pink. It kind of reminds me of St. Germain from Mac. So it, there it is right there. I swatched it. And it feels really like nice and moisturizing and it's pretty pigmented. You kind of have to build it up a little bit, but I am excited to try both of these out. So we'll see how that goes. And then also at Rue 21, I figured that it was time for a new makeup bag to carry in my purse since my other one is pretty worn out and kind of just oldish and raggedy on the inside um, so I got this one it's so cute it says eat sleep contour and it's just a pink little floral print very similar to the one I have now that I got from forever 21 which you guys saw in my recent what's in my purse video uh, but yes yeah, so it was definitely time for a new one and again I think this was like 250 or something like that because it was on sale as well okay now moving on to the clothes <laughs> I got this breast cancer awareness shirt right here. It just says tough enough to wear pink and it is a long sleeve. Um, and I also think it's a mince cause it's fairly large, but it's actually a size small. So it could be a min size. Um, I got this, everything was, this was on the 50% off rack. Originally lowest price was marked Oh, I just hit myself in the eye with the tag. Lowest price marked was $9.99, but it was 50% off of that. So it was like $5. And this is a fun shirt to have just for like, you know, breast cancer awareness events or runs or what have you. So I got that. And then I just got three other items. I didn't get too much at Route 21 because I prefer Ross. So I got this long sleeve and it just looks like so. It's very thin. I mainly got this for the material because it's so thin and soft feeling, but I can pair this with so many like floral skirts or um, like high-waisted skirts. Very, very, very cute. And then I got these adorable, they're a light denim and they are high-waisted shorts. I don't know, these were like, I think these were like um, $12 or something like that. But I really wanted to get some high-waisted shorts, especially in this color, because I love just the look of them and they'll look so cute with some crop tops during the summer. Okay, and then I got this dress. This is the last thing I got from Rue 21. It looks similar to a couple that I already have, but I'm just a sucker for stuff like this. It's so cute. So it's kind of lacy on the sleeves and it has kind of that skater um, skater skirt flare out uh, it cinches a little bit at the waist and then like I said it flares out very cute this is very similar to a dress that I got from I believe it was Rose Gal uh, but I like it so cute I like the light pastelness of it all right now moving on to the stuff I got at Ross so I saw this it's like a little bin and it has super cute uh, polka dot white hearts on it with these cute little handles. And for now, I'm going to use this to store towels in my bathroom. But later on, when I find an actual purpose for it, uh, 
I don't know what I'm gonna use it for, but for now I'll store it um, until I find a purpose for it by using it for towels in my bathroom. So it's really cute. I love it. It's adorable. I couldn't say no to it because it's literally just me. Uh, I store my wigs. A lot of you guys ask how I store my wigs. I store them in big Ziploc bags by themselves individually and then I put all the bags in a bin like this except a little bit smaller because I don't have that many wigs just yet. But uh, yeah, so I'll probably use this as wig storage in the future down the line. Who knows? Okay, now on to the clothes. Oh my gosh. So much floral, I'm so excited. I haven't gotten floral in a really long time. Okay, so the first dress I got looks like this. You can see it's like a mint color with a beautiful floral print, and it comes with like this little necklace. It's wrapped up so it doesn't get ruined, but it's just like a little gem, and you can detach this so it hooks like right to the dress itself, uh, or you can unhook it on both sides and wear it as an actual necklace, which I think is really cool too, so you can wear it separately, and this is just adorable. I love it. And then I got another dress in a similar style to that one, only this one is a little bit darker of a color. So this one's more of a navy blue with this beautiful pink rose flower-ish design on it. Very pretty. It's a little bit thicker, so it might be a little bit hot in the summer. But if I'm indoors where there's cool air conditioning, this will be perfect to wear. Okay, now the next dress I got. This one is perfect because it is short sleeve, but it is high enough up to where I'm not gonna be like showing cleavage and it's a little bit more conservative. Um, again, it's just kind of like a peachy, blushy pink color. And the, there's a little like uh, sheer opening towards the hem, which is very cute. And I just love the look of this one as well. These will all look super cute with like a brown uh, belt cinched at the waist and maybe some cowboy boots or something. And then I got this skirt. Now this is more of a pencils type skirt. It's, I'm, I usually gravitate more towards the skater style skirts, which you guys know, but I decided to try something new. And this is like a pencil skirt. Uh, but again, you wear it kind of high waisted and it's fairly long. So again, it's more conservative but it is so cute I just love the pattern on it very adorable very like vintage feel so cute I love this I figured I could pair this with like a pastel pink crop top or I also got this little crop top right here which I could maybe pair with it it's kind of like a mauvey purple toned color again it's more of a smaller crop top style ish and the back is crisscross and detailed and so cute i love this and it is very stretchy so this one is awesome again i can kind of pair either this or maybe that um long sleeve shirt that i got from rue 21 this one right here maybe i can pair that with that i don't know just so many possibilities i'm so excited about everything now moving on to all the shirts i got four shirts so this one right here just figured I could pair this with some jeans or high-waisted skirt, whatever. It's really cute. It's just got some lace detailing on the shoulders and then it is just a white striped. Again, very cute, very simple and good. Then I got this shirt. This one will look super adorable tucked into high-waisted jeans or high-waisted shorts. Um, it is kind of like an open shoulder t-shirt so it's like a tank top but then you have the attached sleeve with an open shoulder and it's just white just pretty simple pretty basic it's just got that little pop a shoulder detail at the top which will be great for summertime and the last two shirts I got uh, this one right here I can wear with like a camisole underneath of it but it is so cute it's like my favorite one of my favorite shades of pink it has this adorable pattern on it towards the top and then it's just so loose and flowy with a few little buttons on the front and it's so cute I love how flowy and nice this is this will be super cute with some shorts during the summer maybe even over a bikini top or what have you or you could dress it up and maybe wear a cardigan over it or you know just so many different options with all of these clothes and then the last shirt i got is just so simple but so adorable especially with like the unicorn frappuccino hype going around and just unicorns are taking over the world right now i don't know i saw this and it 
just looked adorable. It's a large, so it's gonna be kind of baggy on me, but I couldn't find it in any other size. So I just decided to go ahead with the large. It's just gray and there are some little details along the collar and the sleeves. And then it has the little unicorn emoji right there. Oh, so simply. I figured this would be such a cute little pajama shirt or just to throw on over my swimsuit if I'm running to the pool or wherever you know just I don't know it's so cute it's so stretchy that's why I was hoping that they had a smaller size because it is so stretchy um but that's okay maybe I can shrink it in the wash or something so that is everything that I got from Ross and Rue 21 I hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know in the comments down below which store do you prefer Ross or Rue 21 and why I prefer Ross I feel like Ross has better deals but Rue 21 has like coupons and oftentimes sales like 50% off or they have like a clearance rack regardless what time of year it is uh, so yeah let me know in the comments below what which out of those two your favorite is and with that being said I will talk to you all in my next video so until then so long stay strong stay true and be you all right bye